What is up, everybody? My name is Mike, and you are watching Mike and Hartley Games, and we are playing a new game now, uh, The Legend of Zelda, The Wind Waker. I'm very excited to play this game. I haven't played this game since I was a oof, wee lad, so it's going to be very exciting. I'm very, very pumped for this. Uh, I'm playing it on a GameCube emulator with a 360 controller, but it makes the game 10 times better. I love this controller. I love the game. Two and two together. Amazingness. Okay. Let's get started! No time to waste. Quest log one. Start. Now, my mission here is to, um, to name my guy funny name so that when people pronounce my name, he will say it in the game. They're pretty much referring to themselves. Yes, perfect. Let's start the game. <laughs> Our mission is to get uh, every single person we talk to to come out of the closet, in a sense. This is but one of the legends of which the people speak. Long ago, there existed a kingdom where a golden power lay hidden. The Triforce. Oh. Dun, dun, dun. It was a prosperous land blessed with green forests, tall mountains, and peace. In the Middle East. But one day a man of great evil found the golden power and took it for himself. <coughs> Ganon! <clears throat> Sorry, what? With its strength and his command, he spread darkness across the kingdom. All around it. Into it, everywhere. But then, when all hope had died, an hour of doom seemed at hand. Ha! A young boy, clothed in green, appeared, as if from nowhere. Where did he come from? I don't know. But hey, he saved the day. Wielding the blade of evil's bane, he sealed the dark one away and gave the land light. Oh. This boy who traveled through the time to save through time to save the land. We was known as the hero of time. Blah 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 blah. Yes. The hero of time. The boy's tale was passed down through generations until it became Legend. Legendary. Dairy. Milk. Parmalat. All those things. But then, a day came when a fell wind began to blow across the kingdom. Let me guess. It was the Dark One coming back. Ah, the great evil. That all I thought had been forever sealed away by the hero. Well, guess what? It was back. And it was coming to fuck shit up. Once again, crept forth from the depths of the earth. Eager to resume its dark designs. Oh. The people believed that the hero of time would again come to save them. But no, he didn't. Because he was just a kid. Now probably a fat old man. But the hero did not appear. So everyone got fucked up. Faced by an onslaught of evil, the people could do nothing but appeal to the gods. Okay, seems like a reasonable thing to do after you can't, you know, find a hero. You know, pray for the gods. In the last hour of doom, in the last hour, as doom drew nigh, they left the future in the hands of fate. The worst idea ever. What became of that kingdom? None remained. Who know? It got fucked up. Pretty much. The memory of the kingdom vanished, but its legend survived on the wind's breath. <laughs> on a certain island, it became customary to garb boys in green when they came of age. There you go. Tradition. Clothed in the green of fields, they aspired to find heroic blades and cast down evil. <laughs> Man, let's go find some heroic blades and cast down evil. Okay, buddy. <laughs> the elders wished only for the youths to know courage like the hero of legend. Beautiful. Beautiful story. <laughs> I'm tearing up. Okay. Outset Island. I'm guessing this is where our our protagonist lives. Oh, and who's that? <laughs> Little bitch ahoy! Hi! Big brother! Such 
tiny island, how can you lose your brother? That's my question. Big brother! Oh, maybe he's up there. Playing with the seagulls. Seagulls, get it? The seagulls. The girls. <laughs> yeah. Big brother! He's sleeping up there? Man, it must be freezing up there. Probably has a cold or some shit. Good morning, morning glory. Oh, yeah. There you go. Holy shit! Where'd you come from? I knew it'd be here. Of his face. <laughs> this is my favorite spot to gaze out of the sea when I play with the gulls. I call it Ariel's Lookout. Oh, fascinating. Now, fuck off. So, do you remember what date is today? I don't give a shit, as you can see on my face. You're still half asleep, aren't you? Yes, now fuck off. Did you forget? No, fuck off. <laughs> Big brother, it's your birthday! Okay, never mind. Thank you for telling me it's my birthday. That's why Grandma has been waiting for you to come back to the house. I love the subtext there. Come to the house. She's been waiting for a while now. Fascinating. It's a good thing I came to find you. You should probably go home and see what Grandma wants, don't you think? Maybe, I'll think about it. A scram. Okay. Man, I haven't played this game in such a long time. Oh, it's so exciting. It looks very nice. Compared to, like, the game version, I feel like when you play on a computer, it looks much more pristine. Okay. I'm guessing we go to the house. I, I want to see someone say our name. I want them to come out of the closet for us. Boy, I'm gay! <laughs> There you go! Oh, who would have known? <laughs> hey, is it true that you just have a little courage and run as fast as you can? And you can jump to that rock out there? Huh, is it? Is it? Tell me. I don't know. Man, The Legend of Zelda. Making kids gay since... Whenever it came out. <laughs> look at this guy. What you looking for? Oh my god, look at his face. Okay, I'll just... I'll let you be. Um, your grandma was calling for you, I'm gay. Another one! Another one, there you go. And so was my mom. Fantastic. I don't give a shit. Fuck off! No. What? No, I don't want to come and play. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm gay! <laughs> oh, surprise! <laughs> Happy birthday! <laughs> Hey, did your sister Ariel find you? She was supposed to tell you that your grandmother is looking for you. Speaking of your sister, she saw me at work the other day. She said she wanted you to she wanted to learn how to carry jars on her head, like me, so she could help your grandma with the chores. So, if you see her, tell her that all she has to do is stand in front of a jar and press A. Everyone's controlled by controllers. That's intense. Man, some intense shit is happening here. It's the Matrix. To put the jar down, she has to put- Okay, who gives a fuck? Can you tell her that for me? Yeah, fuck, whatever. Fuck off, let's go. Let's find that old bitch of ours. Grandma! What are you, Grandma? Ooh. Soap. Mmm. Some of that soap. Okay. <laughs> let's get up there. Go, go, go. Oh, look, there she is. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. I'm gay. Oh, Grandma! He came out today. Hi. Fantastic. Oh, again. I'm gay. <laughs> try these on. I don't know if you want to, if I want to try those on now. <laughs> okay. Time certainly flies. I can't believe you're already old enough to wear these clothes. Oh! <laughs> He's so unimpressed. <laughs> you got the hero's clothes. They look like they might be a little warm for this weather. <clears throat> He's so sad. Uh, you're gonna get laughed at, kid. Everyone's gonna hate you. Don't look so disappointed, dear one. Just try them on. 
Today is a day to celebrate. It is the day that you became the same, become the same age as the young hero spoken of in all the legends. You only have to wear them for one, for one day, so don't look so down. Be proud, child. Be gay and proud. In the olden days, this was the day boys were finally considered to be men. They were taught the ways of the sword to prepare them for battle with their enemies. But we don't live in such an age any longer. Our ways are the ways of peace. Nowadays, I suppose Orca is the only one on the island who still knows anything about swordplay. <laughs> swordplay. <laughs> Swords. Hanging the family shield on the wall as decoration, ah, as decoration is another tradition that has been carried down from the old days. From those old days. <laughs> There's the link we've been looking for. Does all this make sense to you? Yes. <laughs> yeah, sure, Grandma, fuck off. Isn't that nice? I'm gay. <laughs> I told you, son. It was gonna be... Today's the day I come out. <laughs> they suit you perfectly. A perfect fit. Well, tonight I'm going to invite the whole town over for your birthday so they can laugh at you in your green suit, you little shit. So I'd be better get... Uh, ha, better... I'd better start getting ready, shouldn't I? Your grandma's going to make your favorite soup for you tonight. Mm -hmm. I just know you're going... You're looking forward to it. Yes. Now go get your sister, Ariel. Alright. <sighs> Finding one bitch after another. Okay. Oh, look at the little family photos. Oh, so cute. Family vacation. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you guys for watching this. I'm super excited to play this game. It's gonna be awesome. Part 2 coming up soon. Like, favorite, subscribe. All those things. See you guys soon. Love you lots. Peace out.